So I've had a crush on her since I was yeah. in like 19. That Nina had dolls in the Super Bowl commercial. I had been loosely <laughs> watching Nina <laughs> as I became a bearded man. Do you ever fantasize about me? Probably. Oh. I get to do it every oh, day. Dreams come true. <laughs> dreams really do come <laughs> true, kids. Well, that dream also came true for another hundreds and millions of other people, Logan. You sent me so many messages. Then why am I? Well, uh, I had two knee, uh, knee surgeries. It sounds like you have Conor McGregor's nutsack in your mouth. Oh, this watch guy it. has re retweet. Uh, watch those little tweets. Like, that's that what I'm saying right there. Like yeah. watching you stumble your way through these sentences is is painful. That's fine. Yeah, agree. But they just want to. Uh, yeah, whatever. Exhibit A. I got better. More. I said I got. Uh, Yo! I said, I said oh, sue get me. Get this man a glass of water. I'd fight Dylan any day. I mean, Dylan, you're a fucking. Thief. How did you go from this talent in the world of BJJ to this guy who hasn't fought since 2019? Well, like, why not just beat up a YouTuber for a ton of money? I think he just wants to be a social media guy. He doesn't actually want to fight. He's that kid who runs away. He's a clown! These little YouTube options, they're going to see what a real fighter feels like. I guarantee you, I knock his ass out. I'm coming off fighting the greatest boxer ever. The next person that I get in the ring with will not walk out of that ring conscious. What happened here? I just told you. No, explain it to me. Logan, I apologize. Huh? I'm a bitch. I'm not a real fighter. Um, I got choked out by a bouncer and I target innocent women online to support my insecurities, honestly. My mom slept with my coach and that's how I got my black belt. What, what are you talking about? When Connor came over, I admit, I let him hit and we saw what happened. I sat watching, crying and drinking Prime. But I love Prime, honestly. I drink it every day. And my favorite flavor is Tropical Punch. It reminds me of the punch that Anthony Taylor <laughs> landed on me, which almost knocked me out. Anyways, drink Prime. Good. Dylan Dallas. Yep. Welcome to London. <laughs> Thank you, bro. Logan Paul. Howdy. Welcome to London. Thanks, bro. How do you feel? I feel good. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna beat <laughs> Dylan. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> uh, I'm glad Dylan showed up to the face to face. It seems like he actually might come to the fight, which excites me. Why are you? What What are you gonna do different? I don't know. I just think I'm a different animal. I think that the way I train, the way that my physicality is, the way that I I don't know. My heart is just different. I don't think he's a real fighter. I admire Dylan's confidence. I am not the same, buddy. Look how you throw body shots. It's a gunshot, kid. Not surprising. Dylan doesn't take boxing serious. He got Velcro gloves. He don't even lace up. He got sketches on his hands. You box like you put together sentences. I got better more. I said I got, uh... You can't. So Logan's fiance submits a restraining order against Dylan. And all of a sudden, Logan starts clapping back on Twitter. Interesting. Has he gone too far on Twitter? Has it affected you in any way? I think he has gone too far, yeah. It's not affected me, no. And he's good. He's a good Twitter troll. But uh, again, when I entered this fight, I knew Dylan was a scumbag. Um, I don't know, bro. This boxing shit sucks. I feel like because I'm in such in his head and like I'm roasting him so hard, I don't think he's ready for what I bring. And I think he doesn't expect, he doesn't know anything about me. He's a, he's a Brazilian jiu-jitsu guy and he's not even good at that. I don't know how he thinks he's going to box. Like striking is his worst forte. I'd like to see him attempt to slap the nose off my face. Logan says striking is his worst forte. Interesting. Boxing, you do not play boxing. Exactly. And Derek Hall now. He needs some milk. He's not good as people think on the mic. Like whenever you go at him, he kind of just like he doesn't have good comebacks. Like he never wants to like kind of engage with me. So it's really stupid. Have you have you gone too far? I don't think so because I only po I only posted public pictures. My fiance is a fucking angel. He's twisted a narrative. My fiance is an angel. Meanwhile. Football stadium full of people once. Who hasn't? <laughs> An angel? More like a fallen angel, cream gobbling succubus. Foods that make other of you gag. Um, my gag Look at the reaction here. is pretty strong. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I have to say, it, okay. it will take, it will take, <laughs> okay. take a long <laughs> Okay. okay. So look, this is one of those things where now Dylan Dennis has come in and he's been bringing up, he's, you know, he's fighting this guy, Logan Paul, and he's brought up the fact that she's been with pretty much every man, you know, since the Everyone! history of a, yeah, going back to Charlotte Pipkus. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Here is kind of the twist, is this same person, Agdal, she withheld 
uh, sex, and I don't know if it's for moral reasons, from this guy, Logan Paul, for an extended period of time. You, you not having sex with me for the duration of time that you did was very important. You thought something was wrong with me. I thought I did. <laughs> and I, I have reason to believe that there's probably something wrong with it because if it's too good to be true, probably is. Wait, it's too good to be true to be with the woman who slept with everyone but yourself? You know the roast and this goes hard when they try to sue and file a lawsuit against you. Has Dylan Dennis finally gone too far? A restraining order might mean yes. Dylan Dennis has brutally gone after Logan Paul's fiance, Nina Agdell, leading up to their fight on October 14th. As reported by TMZ, Nina Agdell is suing Dylan Dennis for no less than $150,000, all for sharing intimate images of her, which is in direct violation of federal law. She also suggested that Dennis had hacked her personal account or had obtained the private video from someone who had done so. Dylan has responded on his social. Nina Agdell has filed a massive lawsuit and restraining order against me. I won't stop. Come get me. Logan Paul is a dead man walking. Nina files a restraining order against Dylan, who is never around her. The only guys who are around her, well, every other male on earth. Every day I would pull up my Twitter, I'd be tweeting, and I would just see another picture of her with another famous guy, Shark Boy, Leonardo DiCaprio got in there. This can't get worse. Till Dylan tweeted yesterday, he said, if I dropped this picture, it would end the fight, end his engagement, and I might even find myself in jail. So Andrew tweets back at him. I was trying very hard not to get involved in this, and I'm still trying to stay out of this. But I opened my Twitter inbox and had a message from Dylan, and he's really not lying. What is it, a sex Obviously, he denies everything. I mean, and he's he denies right his freaking girl being with 75 guys. There's 75 pictures of her making out with guys, so. Me and my girl don't have to defend ourselves or try to prove our love for the world. It's not my fault, you know, that he wiped up a, a whore. It's it's the only thing he cares about. Yeah. And he's going to pay for it. October 14th. He's going to learn a hard lesson. I think he's going to get what's coming to him. A few weeks to go. Till October the 14th. Are you going to maybe go easy a little bit on Twitter now? Or are no. you going to go through the gears? Keep going. No, non-stop. Always in his head. When he sleeps at night, he's thinking about me. When he's fucking his girl, he's thinking about me. So I got him <laughs> in my pocket. I'm in his head eating Japanese sushi and he's eating roast beef every night, so. Damn! He needs some milk! It, su it sucks, to be honest. It sucks. It sucks being in the position that I'm in. And, like, the Twitter noise, bro. Understand this. I've been the most hated person in the world at one point. Mm -hmm. Like, really. Well, you still kind of are, buddy. Because with the millions of dollars you took from innocent people with your crypto scam, they are still waiting for their money back. And when Logan says, it hasn't affected me at all, you can tell that this man is rattled by the whole situation and Dylan has gotten inside his head. Um, I feel like I, I'm so hated and I, I dealt with so much hate throughout my life that like nothing affects me. I, I, I'm so used to this. Like There's nothing he could say that would bother me at all. And I could tell he's like really wind up, so he's not used to it. Yo, if you put your phone down, social media does not exist. Yeah. It's not a real place. And I get that. And it's good. It's good promo for the fight. I was asking where is he injecting his ass or his chest? Like we see the marks and he, he was like all flipped out. So we'll see. I think with this back and forth, he's going to come at me hot. And I think Dylan's in for a fucking surprise that night. So stupid. Make sure you get a prenup. Dylan, thank you very much for no taking problem. the time. I know it's been a long day. Yeah, no problem, bro. That. Take it easy. Thank you, mom. Drink prime. That's a great promo you've certainly been working on. Little did you guys know, Dylan, he is low-key looking out for Logan. Because if you don't pay attention to a woman's past, her past will come back and ruin your future. Because past performance is a representation of future performance. If the relationships didn't work out in the past with other guys, what makes you think that this relationship will work out with Logan? Because remember, gentlemen, no matter how many times Nina brushes her teeth at night, Every time she kisses Logan, there's still that odd taste. I'll give you a hint. Cock and balls. And gentlemen, that's it for today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. He posted nudes of his girl, bro. If anything, I'm showing her off.
I know. They weren't great tits, but like, I mean, come yeah. on. I was like gonna praise them because like, you know, I'm all about like trans and like LGBTQ and everything. So I was gonna be like, oh, this is awesome. He like has a fiance that's trans. So I thought You're she was. Fucked. And then I looked it up and it, and it was a girl. And then I started seeing all the stuff. So I was like, oh, she's, shit. she's gorgeous though. You think you know me. Oh, he needs oh. some milk.